Hello everybody, you're watching live again with B-Man Dan. Today we're doing a beehive removal up in the eaves that I showed in my last video. They're right there. So quick to find a reason to see the They're really quick. Brood comb with lots of drone. My goodness, that is a lot of drone. So this is the brood comb. You can tell by how small that is, and then this is the drone by, how, and you can tell by how much it like really pips out and it's large. There's some that are uncapped, so this is ow, relatively new. Same on the other side, ow. I'm probably gonna have to go get that. Before I do, let me, oh, look at that. That is beautiful. Beautiful worker uh, bee lane pattern. And look at this on the side here. These are queen cups. This is what they will use to make a new queen. Uh, let's see if I can't get by with this one. This one's my favorite tool to use. This has got an angle and so whenever I scrape along the comb. I'm not bashing my knuckles into the wall so much, but the challenge, the downside of it is that it does have reach uh, challenges. for now. I don't like it too bad. You can also move so you can get to your comb. Oh, thank goodness it stopped right there. The bees are no doubt behind that little crevice. And, and there they can stay for now. All right. Turn this around. The skyless pan is ex exceptionally helpful in this instance. And you know, I picked up that tip 
long time ago, and I was just always so lazy about getting a pen. I think I'm going to do a lot better about having this from now on. So, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to hit that like, thumbs up, and uh, subscribe. 